The Tres Marias theme is common in Pinoy art for reasons I have no idea why. You can ask your art professor for that, but don't get me wrong. I don't hate it. I like it. In fact, I have a piece in my collection. But I never fully realized there was a pattern until I saw Myrna Pashon Arenas' work, which I will show you in a few seconds. I saw depictions usually in our Pinoy art Tres Marias that are as old as our Spanish heritage. They are always set in a bygone era. They are also always young ladies looking very demure and domesticated. And this is why I love Tres Socialeras. First of all, they belong in the here and now. They are not fresh out of college. If they are selling flowers, they have people working for them. They have an urban fashion sense. They may also be housewives like our traditional Tres Marias, but you won't see them slaving away. But those are not the only reasons that make this art piece so 21st century. Look at their skin tone. They're not mestizos. They're all shades of Kayumangi. Usually, when we conjure images of a sophisticated Filipina, we think of them as fair-skinned, but Arenas presents as morenas in the upper strata of society and looking so confident in their skin. No good attire for them. And unlike the traditional Tres Marias, only one here has long hair, and she puts them up in a bun. Typical Filipinas find their beauty in their long locks, thanks to shampoo commercials. But here we see our Filipinas with bobs, and horror of horrors, one even dares to show her grade. Myrna Pasion Arenas is not a one-trick pony when it comes to the Tres Marias theme. She shows us, once again, her interpretation by painting a mother and her daughters. Yes, the Tres Marias can be multi-generational as well. And once again, true to her style, the artist plucks them out of the centuries past and puts them in vibrant Instagram era with their OOTD. But more than being fashionistas, Arena shows the love between a mother and her daughters by titling her work Daughter's Best Friend. More than passing on to her girls her sense of style, she has succeeded where most mothers fail in the name of generational gap. Her daughters call her their best friend, and for a mother, that is synonymous to being called blessed. Arena succeeds not only in interpreting the Tres Marias theme, but the sentimental Pinoy mother and child, where the child is always an infant. Arena shows that the bond can go beyond infancy and sustain it through the turbulent teenage years. And that is the modern Filipina, who can do it all. Follow Myrna Passion Arenas and be enthralled with more depictions of the empowered woman and the empowered Filipina. An empowered Filipina is essential. Art is essential.